All right, folks, welcome back to another one. We finally made it to Beaverton, Ontario. We finally got ourselves a little vacation. So this out here is Lake Simcoe. And yes, we brought the boat. We're gonna try and do some fishing, have a little fun on the water. Although we're here for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, it's supposed to rain all day Saturday and all day Sunday, but we're gonna make the best of it anyways. We'd like you to join us. All right, well, as we start, as we start day one here in Beaverton, I must say, Lake Simcoe, your water is clear. I mean, clear. I've never been here before. Anyway, today's agenda, hopefully the rain holds off. It's supposed to come down. We're going to get the boat out, try and do a little fishing. The lake is glassy. Have a look. Just beautiful. Just had an otter run across the pier here. I'm gonna tell you up front, the people in Beaverton, not friendly at all. Uh, and I don't mean that as in the citizens, I mean that as in, well, maybe they are citizens. I mean that as in the people that work in the stores, the Barney's restaurant here at the canal where we're, where we're spending, rude. Everywhere else, rude. Um, we wouldn't be back at all. This is our Airbnb. It's built over top of the canal, so the water is underneath us right now. And here we are. This is it. This is a kitchen. Patio goes over the canal. Living room. We got a bedroom on that side. Bedroom on that side. That's the bathroom. And up there, <laughs> that is also a bedroom. Now, we just came in off the water, off of Lake Simcoe. We did take the boat out. The storm went around the other way. However, another one popped up, so we had to come back in. Now, the boat launch was packed. I mean, it was busy. So, we didn't have time for setting up cameras, taking cameras down, but you kind of know how it is. Water's water, right? Anyway, I'm going to show you our view from the balcony. So, there's Lake Simcoe. This is the canal. The boat launch is right there. Now, like I said, the launch was packed. They're waiting to get in. Now, you got to park about a six minute walk from the boat launch. So, you got to go park your boat, come back. So, it takes a little bit of time. But look at the view. So, you're right across Lake Simcoe over there. Now, if these trees weren't all here, you can see right across there. But other than that, this morning, right up on top of that, there was a bald eagle. So, that was pretty cool. So this morning I brought the fishing rod down to the pier and they're telling me that there's smallmouth bass in here. I haven't seen one, nor did I catch one. Hard to tell, but that water is pretty clear. And I did see a lot of bluegill in there, so we're gonna try and catch bluegill off this dock. Now we're about 25 feet off the water. Under here is a garage where the guy drives his boat in, but we're not putting our boat in there. Our boat's on the trailer in the parking lot. Anyway, the rest of the folks are down at the beach. I'm going to head over there. We're going to spend a little bit of time there. And I think we're going to try and find some barbecue.
Hey, uh, Jenny. What do you think? <laughs> uh, you all heard that. She said get two. We're at Bass Pro Shop in Vaughn. Uh, I think she had enough of the mall in there. We got some camo. I'll show you that a little bit later. I'm digging these golf carts though. Yeah. Can you get two of these too? And one of those? We'll sell them to clean the driveway with. You cannot believe the price of camo nowadays. $300 for camo pants. You believe that? $300. Hey, I ain't talking to myself. Well, you're talking to us or them or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> you guys listen to me though? This is why you avoid the 401 at all costs. It's always like this, day or night, bumper to bumper. <laughs> 